Hello guys, welcome to our channel SM Traders Smart Marketing Solutions Nowadays everyone is facing a problem that is the high cost of yesterday so that we cannot do anything So SM Traders got a solution for that Shortly I will come into the market Today I am going to introduce a new model stuff that is we can use inside the house, outside the house and by traveling also the name of the stove is Biomass Stove. The speciality of the stove is smokeless. So shortly we can unbox the stove. Yes, this is our stove. Looks beautiful and high finish. Okay, we can take it outside. Inside there is an adapter of 6 volt that we can keep aside. Here this is the main chamber of the stove that we can put the fire bricks or coal etc like that. The important part of the stove this portion. This is a chamber of 8 inch dia and there is a tray here we can pull the coal or firewoods into the chamber so this is a top portion of the stove now we can come to the front side of the stove okay this is the front side in the front side there is a regulator is there now the regulator is in the off position so that we can make low to high see then beside that one socket is there this is a chargeable socket that is 6 volt socket and LEDs is here the indication LEDs is here then next is a valve is also here so later I will explain each and everything next we can come into the manufacturing side and technical side so first I will explain full details about the manufacturing side in the manufacturing side the top portion there is four spokes is there that is heavy spoke that is to place the tumblers and etc like that then the stove is built up with MS steel that is mild steel then there is four legs is there that is full strong it's manufactured with MS steel so the stove gets more strong and more reliability now we can come to the painting part first they painted with high quality primer then after that they painted with black powder coat the speciality of the powder coating is it will be long last so see the beauty and finish of the stuff Next we can come into the technical side of the stove. In the technical side I will explain the size of the stove, length of the stove, weight of the stove and the internal parts. So the size, the length is 23 inches, the width is 15 inches, height is 9 inches and the weight is 6 kilograms. So the stove is capable to use any kitchen that is small or big kitchens and by traveling when you are going to excursion or picnic it is very capable for using the stove no problem at all Next we can look the bottom part of the stove the bottom part means internal part of the stove See this is the internal portion of the stove
in the internal portion also it is painted with beautiful and it is assembled with beautiful first i will explain the pcb board here is the pcb board is there its control its regulator control is fitted within then after that it is linked with a 6 volt leaded battery then connected with a motor of 6 volt with the blower when the stove gets on the blower pulls the air into the chamber then it will get the fire in the bottom of part of the chamber it is built up with a valve to clear the ashes and everything in the bottom side of the chamber so these are the things situated in the bottom part of the biomass stove so you saw all about the stove the manufacturing side and the technical side and the bottom parts everything is on then where we have to keep the stove when working in the working time we can keep the stove in the tile that's above the tile above the wood above the table no problem for that so no temperature will come under the portion where the stove gets so it is very comfortable for using the stove in anywhere now let us charge the stove in the charging it is very 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 simple anyone can do it very simple like the mobile charge see this is a 6 volt charger here is the socket there is two pins is there one is small and big in the big pin you have to place here switch on so a red indicator light will glow here this is the charging bay in the initial time that is the first time we have to charge the stove in 8 hours continuously then after using the stove only we have to charge 2 hours then it will be get full charge when it is full charge now we are using the stove on full flame it will get 6 hours continuously running time then when, it, when we decrease it low position it will get 10 hours in any other circumstances, in the stove, the battery is in a dead portion. That is, no charge in the battery. Then also you can use the stove without any worry. At the time, you are thinking that yeah, I have to charge the battery for two hours, then only I have to cook. Don't get worried. You can place the charger and switch on the socket. Then use the charger and you can run the stove. No problem at all. So at that time, the battery gets charged also, you have to cook also. It's a very good thing in this idea. Next is the most important thing you have to know with the biomass stuff. Which all types, that is what all types the utensils we can kept in the stuff. So the stuff is more heavy, then also we can keep the small utensils like this. You, you will familiar with this utensil now that we can fry the mustard, cumin seed, little little cooking we are using this one. So we can get this also. See, no shakes, it's, it's placing stable, see, no other problems is there. Next, salt, this is also you have to know that is we have to boil the milk. It is also stable, no problem. Next, somewhat big. That is for rice, for boiling water. See, very stable, very convenient. The next is this pot. This is a natural pot. This is also very stable and very convenient. Next, we can place the normal pans. See this one. This is a small pan. This is a big pan. See, stable, stable and seating. This is also stable and seating. Next one, this is for chapati and dosha, something like that. This is also seating and stable. See, no other shaking. Next, next one, 
Next we are placing a big urli. Brass urli. See this is also stable and seating. No other issues. Next we can come into the biryani pot. This is for 10 to 15 persons biryani pot. See this is also stable and No other issues. Next we can place the 5 liter cooker. See, very convenient. Next we are going to keep a big dara that is for 200 to 250 people for making food. So we can look at it. This is a big dara. This is also very stable, very seating, very comfortable, no other issues. So the stove will take the load, that is the stove is made up of four heavy legs, that is why there is no much issues from the stove. So you have seen the full details of the biomass stove, that is the manufacturing part and the technical part. I hope you understood that. Now let's switch on the stove. Before switch on the stove, you have to make sure the battery gets fully charged or you have to connect the adapter in the So that we are using first, first I am showing this is the coconut shell that you will get from your house, it's very familiar, everyone is familiar with the coconut shell or the waste pieces of the wood. That this is the one part. On the next part, I will show some other things also. That is for the people who is residing in the township or in the flats or by traveling etc. So these are the things. There is a charcoal that can get it from the shops. This also we can use in the store. The next is the wooden pellets. This is also very capable for using in the biomass store. See this one. This is the compressed charcoal capsule. This is also very good for using in this stove. This gets, this gets very low smoke. So we can make the stove work. First I am using this one. Because now everyone will get this easily. After a minute, we can switch on the regulator into low position. So see the pressure of the fire, it gets highly pressured. Now we can make the stove off. So see here there is no smoke at all. So that is the speciality of the biomass stove. Now let's burn the charcoal. First we can place the charcoal capsule Then some charcoal pieces Then some pellets also This is enough Now it gets fired. So after one minute, we can switch on the regulator as shown before. Yes, after one minute, we can switch on the regulator. Now see, now see the pressure. See, after 10 minutes, the pressure of the stove is very high. Now we, now we can make switch off the stove. See, there is no smoke in the kitchen. So I think it's very convenient for using this stove in the kitchen, outside or in the traveling. It's very capable for every human to use this stove. See, 
now the stove is in the off position now we can see the position of the capsule see after 10 minutes the wear and tear nothing has happened this we can use again again and again so i hope it can be used more than one hour so i hope this is more better than the other fat substances because now this stove you can use inside the kitchen outside the kitchen by traveling it's very convenient for every human to use this bio stove this charcoal capsule now it is available in every supermarkets small small shops everywhere it's available if it is not available then you can use the local charcoal also no problem see we burnt 20 minutes that is the natural coconut shell then the coal everything we burnt after 20 minutes of burning what is happened in the ash pit so we can check out see so this is the ash this is the waste so you have to remove while after one hour or two hour cooking like this so it is more convenient for you so i burn the stove in the two different ways i hope you understood it i hope you like it so this bio stove is marketed by sm trade smart marketing solutions and same sm trade is giving the home delivery in all over india so if you like this video and if you wanted to order the full details and full enquiry and full booking is given available in the description box so thank you for watching this video